everyone, welcome back. Today, I'm going to be working on this clock body. Um, a good friend of mine brought it back from Germany, and she wants it. She wants it, the grain to show up, but it to be a little bit like a whitewash, so it brightens it up because it's very dark and heavy. Um, it's absolutely beautiful. We're going to put glass shelves in it so she can display stuff. Let me turn the camera around and I'll show you what it looks like. The bonnet comes off the top. This is the bonnet from here up. So we'll take that off and we're going to do this piece first and then we'll work on the body. I already have the back taken off. She gave me some gold paper foil that I put on the back that'll be behind the shelves. So yeah, let's get this off there and get it going. It is so big, it doesn't fit in my shop because of the bracing in the top of my shop. So <clears throat> there's only one spot where it'll fit. And I can't work on it there. And obviously, I can't work on it when it's up in the air either. So, just going to get rid of some of the cobwebs. try to find a dark sample. And I think possibly it's not exactly the same. But I'm going to use the back of this and see how that looks. So let's do a little sample here. This is pretty. This is the back of a chair. And I'll use this side for something, but I'm going to do a little sample on this side. So I bought this. This is flagstone. I don't know if you guys can see that it's a very light color. We're going to try it out. Wax on, wax off. Make sure you move your container around really well so you get everything off the bottom. Now well, let's see if we got uh, I think what I'm going to do, put it on with a brush, wipe it off with a rag. How does that sound? See if that gives any more control.
Well, it doesn't do a lot. I have a white one. I guess we get to try this one out. <sighs> Thought the white would be too white for her. Um, but, seeing where this one hasn't really done anything at all. Try the white one. Well, that's better. I think that's what we're looking for. The other one was just too light. See how it rubs on? Actually, I can just probably rub it on with a cloth, too. Look at that. And I think that's exactly what she's looking for. Once we start it, there ain't no going back. So, let's see what we got going on here. Get rid of this guy. This, that. All right, where do we want to start? Ah, I'm just gonna, whoo, just gonna start, I guess. And I'm going to wear my respirator. That's too strong. Just keep on wiping it back until you get the effect that you want. You just keep on wiping it back until you get the effect you want.
think I'm happy. I think I'm happy with that. I was going to put the base on my spinner, but I think maybe it'll be better if it's not moving. Alright, well, let's try it out. Here goes nothing. Always stressful doing this. Sometimes you gotta just do it. This is the this is the part I'm most excited about. Now I'm going to want to put these two pieces together to make sure the shadowing is proper. I'm 
I need a new pair of gloves. Alright, I'm going to let that dry overnight, and we'll come back if we need to do any touch-ups, we'll do that. See you on the next video!